Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and welcome to my video on how to get glowing skin. Yes, that's right. I'm going to give you my most recent big secret and I'm so excited about this. As many of you who have followed my channel know, for the past two and a half years since I started my channel, I have been using Retin-A and it has made a very positive difference in my skin. However, and I will say this, and this is really true about Retin-A users, if you don't use a product to slough off those extra skin cells that Retin-A produces, because Retin-A is constantly sloughing off your skin, then you're going to look kind of dry and dull and irritated and red. And in fact, my sister will not use Retin-A because she calls the Retin-A look the big red lobster look. And I have to admit that for much of my time on Retin-A before I started using these two products, I didn't get that glowing, wonderful skin, that more youthful looking skin that I really thought that Retin-A promised. And these two products have really been game changers in terms of bringing on the glow and giving my skin that more youthful, dewy look. And first, if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in all things anti-aging, including my Retin-A journey, then I hope you'll click that bell that will send you notification of my future videos. And if you could give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends, that would be great too. Okay, let me get into these products and I am so excited to share these with you. Both of these products are from Neostrata and I bought these online after doing a lot of research on Amazon. That's how I find my skincare products often is that I go to Amazon and I look for very highly rated products and I really read the reviews to make sure I believe they're honest reviews and these Neostrata products were very highly rated. And the first product that I've added to my skincare regimen is a moisturizer, but it is a moisturizer with a kick because it has glycolic acid. In fact, this little product has 15% glycolic acid. I started with a little higher strength than I should. If you are just starting this product, you should start with a 10% strength, and I'll put links below to both products. But this is the Neostrata Resurface Cream, it's called Face Cream Plus, and it's the step up level, so it's the 15% glycolic. And this is designed to be used once a day at first in the evenings, and then twice a day thereafter, after the first couple of weeks, when you make sure your skin can handle it. But this is just a moisturizer that I've added to my skincare in the evening, and I did do it just exactly how they instructed. I have used this now for about the past month. And I will say that when you first start using this product, because it does have a 10 or 15% glycolic acid in it, you're going to get a little bit red when you first apply it. But I did just apply this at night for the first couple of weeks. And although I would get red in the evening, especially during that first week of applying this product, when I would wake up in the morning, my skin would just look dewy and fresh. And I think, as you can tell, my skin really is looking much, much better. It is just having a more even textured tone overall. And I really think this product is helping bring on the glow. And in addition to using that 15% AHA product, and again, I would recommend you start at the 10 if you're not used to using the glycolic acids, but another wonderful product that I've been using, and I think I'm on my third peel on this now, you use this peel once a week, and this is the Neostrata Skin Active Repair Perfecting Peel. And they call this a weekly AHA regenerative treatment, and I really love this. And let me show you how it looks inside, and it is a little pricey, I think it's $79, but you get a three month supply, which is 13 peel pads, and basically how you do this, and I just did it last night again for my third time, is that you take one of these little peel pads and you use the first one here, which is peel pad one, and that is the AHA acid, and you just apply that all over your skin and your neck if your neck can tolerate the AHAs. And if you're not used to it on your neck, I would apply this very sparingly. And basically you apply this and let it wait 10 minutes, and so what I did to make sure that I was getting all of this is the minute my face would start drying out again, I would go ahead and reuse that peel pad because the peel pad does stay wet. Although I did notice that within a few minutes, the peel pad solution would dry on my skin and that's where I'd go back in with that peel pad again. And again, if you're not used to using this on your neck, I would just do the neck maybe once and don't go down and repeat the peel pads on there. And I will say that it does have a little bit of a sting. I wouldn't say it hurts exactly, but you can definitely tell that it is doing something. And what that AHA acid is doing is that it is lifting up the dead skin cells, it's peeling them away, and it's leaving you with more glowing skin. 
And then at the 10 minute point, and it's kind of hard to wait, I have to say, because it's a little scary the first time you use it, but after the first time you realize it really does not harm your skin. It really just helps bring on that glow. And then you neutralize it with the peel pad number two, and that feels actually very good on your skin. You just rub that damp peel pad all around your face and your neck, and that just neutralizes that solution on your skin. And it has a little bit of a texture to it, so if you kind of scruffle it against your skin, it's also helping you get rid of some of those dead skin cells. Although don't overdo it, especially if you're just starting out. And then after you've used the neutralizer pad, and I would again run that over your skin several times to make sure everything's all nice and neutralized. And then you just follow up with water and or a damp cloth, which gets any remaining peel solution or neutralizer off of your face. And then you just pat your face dry. And here is a look at the results Neostrata showed on their website after these people had used the Perfecting Peel Solution for the entire three months. And as you can tell, the skin just looks a little glowier, a little brighter, and it is kind of nulling out those brown spots. And to me, in the after picture, it's just giving you a more even skin tone, better clarity, and just bringing on the glow. Well, if you're interested in learning more about those great Neostrata products, and again, I am not sponsored, they have no idea who I am, but I will put links to those products below so you can learn a little more. Absolutely wonderful products, and to me, they are a game changer in bringing on some smooth, glowing skin. And if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in all things anti-aging, I hope you'll click that little bell to be notified of my future videos. Give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends too. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I've been using these Miracles Now cards from Gabrielle Bernstein. Let's go ahead and see what we can think about for today. Ooh, this is a weird one. I don't dance around the perimeter of the person I want to be. I step in fully and completely. I don't dance around the perimeter of the person I want to be. I step in fully and completely. Oh, friends, this card packs a huge punch, and I think it's true for each and every one of us. You know, there is a person that God created us to be on this earth. No matter what your religious belief, if you don't believe in God, you know, that's just fine. But in my personal belief, God created me to be a certain way, and he gave each of us certain gifts and blessings. And I think having been given those gifts and blessings, it's up to us to step into that person and to live our lives fully and to live our lives without fear. And one thing I've been doing lately, and actually I just started this at a sermon I heard a couple of weeks ago, is the idea to pray without ceasing. And no matter what your religious belief is, you can use this idea, which is that sometimes we kind of shy away from the person we want to be. We kind of are a little bit afraid, something like that. We have a lot of fear. But when you pray without ceasing, you say, God or the universe, this is the situation in my life, and I know you mean to bring it on for my good, so bring it on. God or the universe, help me be the best person I can be. And so friends, just for today, let's think about who God wanted us to be, and let's try to step into that person and live it fully. Take care, and I'll see you in my next video.